Hey everyone, what's going on? Uh, this is 1A Dog 1, and I'm uh, coming at you from, uh, well, a familiar sight to most of you, um, or to some of you at least. Um, this is my, uh, this is the world that I made the uh, secret TNT room and, ju and uh, jukebox store tutorial. Um, and uh, I've decided to make this kind of my t personal testing world. And uh, whenever I find out something, whenever I have like a new idea, I'm just gonna bring you guys over here, and uh, kind of just uh, yeah, get your get your influence or get your uh, preference on it. So uh, today, um, well, let's start with a story at least, or at least a short one. Um, I was messing around on the flowerpot server with that webling kid and uh, Benny, or uh, be creative. I can't remember the numbers after his name. Um, and, uh, we were having some trouble with a, uh, door. The door was opening fine, but it wouldn't close fast. Sorry, it would close too fast. So, uh, let me bring myself out of creative mode here. Uh, slash game mode. Oh, okay. So, um, here I've decided to call it the redstone off delay circuit. Um, it's, it's a pretty... Uh, it's complicated to look at, but in reality, it's pretty simple. Let me just get a sip of my tea. Hmm. And I only have one headphone in for some reason. Let me put that in. Okay. So. Anyway, we have two systems here. Uh, I have the old normal system. And I'm, and I'm going to demonstrate why this is really annoying. Oh. See what I mean? I mean, it, it, I kind of tried to do it that second time, but come on. I'm starting from back here. I'm just going to walk. Oh, well, yeah. Um, but say you're in a place where... God damn it. See what I mean? Well, say you're in a place where you need to get back from or move, turn a corner or something. This system is going to give you issues. But anyway, so this is the old system. It's essentially a redstone torch. Um, it created an inverter system here, and here's the um, uh, here's the entrance, and here's the exit button, and it all goes over here and works fine. But you can, st but it's still incredibly annoying when you have the button say farther away from the door because of uh, location or something like that. So while we were messing around, I developed a uh, new system, which I'll show you in a second after I demonstrate. Now, which, which, let's watch this again, it's kind of obvious, but which one is faster? Yeah, yeah, see? So, um, I'm going to show you the complicated part, which looks complicated even though it's really not because it has all the inputs and stuff. So, here's the first button, here's the second button, and this right here is the system. Try to ignore everything before this, and then this is the actual system. So essentially, what this um, so essentially what this does is this utilizes a a, red, a little known redstone repeater um, use um, in which you can lock redstone repeaters. So if I bring myself back into creative again, and the music just stopped after I went into creative, which is weird. No, stupid rain. Shall we? So, now if we look at this, you see those locks right there? Oh, shoot. Uh, sorry, uh, let me just fix that quickly. So that's what this thing is based around. Essentially, it locks these in the on position until these go around, which keeps it, which uh, which keeps the door open longer. So if we go through here, I've got a little demonstration set up for you guys, or kind of a demonstration. Um, this is a basic. This is the circuit essentially. The input is right here, and the output is right here. And this works if I were to. Activate it, and as you can see, it works fine. Thing. 
And the, the base system requires 15 redstone 9 repeaters, and it'll keep the door open for 2.5 seconds. Hmm. So, um, there's that. And if, if you really don't get this still, because uh, I know some people aren't great with redstone naturally or just need a little help sometimes, um, let me actually just do this quickly. I know I don't have to, but it looks better. This is the TNT room, by the way. Um, okay. So with that done, um, if you guys don't understand this, which some of you probably won't, just it's a bit complicated with all these repeaters everywhere, and you're like, what the hell's going on? So I've set up the most basic demonstration I can tell I can teach you about. This is the this is the this is a demonstration of the repeater locking system, which simply enough is this. That right there means the repeater is locked, which means I cannot change the state of it. But if I turn this off and turn this on, now check this out. Huh? So essentially all this locking system does is keep it in the state that it originally was. It doesn't keep it off. It doesn't lock it in the off position. It locks it in whatever position it was on when uh, the lock was activated. So that's essentially how that works. Um, this is probably a pretty short video. It's a simple system. Um, it, it doesn't take an incredible amount of time to set up. And as you can see, 15 redstone, 9 repeaters, 2.5 seconds. And this can be increased by increasing the amount of repeaters right here. These repeaters will increase this. Um, increasing the number of complete systems will also complete it or increase the number of these line repeaters here will also do it. But, um, what it will not do is, uh, well, what it will do is require more resources than if you were to just add a couple of repeaters onto here, which, as I said, does work. Um, what you do have to make sure, though, is that these right here are in the top position, or else it will lock. And, uh, actually, will it? Yeah, I think it'll, yeah, it will, it will lock as I'll demonstrate. Uh, oh, no it won't. Um, but yeah, that's just a faster way to open it. So, there, so there's a bit of time control for you that I didn't even know about. Once again, I didn't go and like look up this or anything. I checked it out um, on the server. And uh, I designed it myself. Probably Someone's probably done it before, but I designed it myself. So it's a neat system. And I thought it might, I thought it might be worth showing you guys. There we go. Um, so yeah, so whenever I uh, come up with something new, I'm just going to uh, bring you guys onto this server, or not the server, this is actually a, a single player world, and uh, just do that. Oh god, this is the annoying system I was trying to come up with. Essentially, what I was trying to do was come up with a uh, 9x9 nine nine completely filled in door with this filled in, and I had no idea how to do it, so yeah, sorry. <laughs> Too. That was a long time ago. That was on the, uh, jeez, that must have been the, uh, uh, let me think. Yeah, that was the Cyberdog server, actually, when I, when I tried to come up with that. It didn't work. Um, I never figured out how to do it. But, uh, let me turn this bloody music off. It's really annoying. What? Did I? The music is off. Can you can you hear that? Can you hear that? That's music, and this is really effing annoying. So yeah, um, this has been One A Dog One, and uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, goodbye everyone. Goodbye. I'm a pilot. Goodbye. Bye.